let's talk about the Mate 20 X 5G and the M Pen. With the M Pen, you can press a button and double tap the screen to get a screenshot taken. You can also draw around something to get a shaped screenshot taken. All things you could have done with your knuckles on phones as far back as the Huawei P8. But you can also press a button and tap the screen and you can very easily take a note, press a tick button, share it out. The choice is yours. What people may not realize about this though is that it is an artist's tool with the Wacom Digital under the hood. The M Pen can f enable 4096 levels of pressure sensitivity. So while it can't do the shaky handy things a note pen can do, it can still deliver all the smarts to create stuff like this and more. This is a speed sketch. I'm going to show you how I drew this using Autodesk Sketchbook Pro. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, please do for more cool content like this. Let's get drawing.
Thanks for watching this speed sketch using the Mate 20X 5G. As you can see, I've worked across a lot of layers. I can zhuzh her hair up, make it even pinker and more fantastical. I can even get rid of her skin tones and make her blue, but I'm not going to do that. What I am going to say is, as far as the user experience on the pen goes, it has a harder nib than the Note series. It isn't quite as comfortable and it isn't quite as accurate, but it is still perfectly, perfectly usable. Mentally, you calibrate to it very, very quickly, and it's really enjoyable to draw stuff like this. In addition, the pre-fitted screen protector puts my mind at ease that I'm not scratching up the screen itself, despite the fact the nib is harder. For more on the Mate 20 X 5G and all the goings on here on Let's Talk About tech, please subscribe to the channel. It's how you stay on top of everything that I do.